We're on the cusp of a colossal occasion, a semi-final encounter here at the Euros, and the nerves must surely be jangling. Who will come out on top? Action coming up, live. It's Belgium against France at the semi-final stage of the Euros, and this should be a technical football lover's delight. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by Stuart Robson. Stuart, looking at the strengths and weaknesses of the two teams, let's emphasise the strengths. Absolutely. France plays some great football. They've got some world-class players. So too have Belgium. But when I look at the two teams getting into this stage of the tournament, I still think France are the better side. And I expect them to win today. Not by a lot, though. Now the pass not finding its target. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Well, it came to nothing in the end. The starting players for Belgium. A vastly experienced Belgian Kuhn Castells will be in goal. Yuri Tiedemans plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of the park and handed the task of playing up front today, Romelu Lukaku. Teo Hernandez. Really good build up, but no end product. Fass. A credit to him for the challenge and the throw in conceded. Artur Teat. And a throw in here for France. Griezmann, Chouameni, Theo Hernandez now, went in strongly, decisively, and the referee blows for a foul, well he's gone into the book, well he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Mbappe. Well, the supporters think it's on. Vertonghen's block. Cuts it back. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Tielemans. Romelu Lukaku now. No well, possibilities in the centre. Splendid defending. Amadou Onana taking it forward now Lukaku Fass De Bruyne now Castagne and the flag is up offside well that's just a lack of awareness he was clearly in an offside position A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved the yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. N'Golo Conte. 
Dembele. Now Conte. A good and fair challenge. Jeremy Doku. Vertonghen with it. Fass. Tielemans. Moving the ball nicely, but can they forge ahead? And Belgium moving the ball with purpose. Well, it's such an eye-catching series of passes. Well, there's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Kylian Mbappe. Conte. Koundé. On to Griezmann. Dembele, Mbappé! Luca Bacchio. Well, he's given us away. Maneuvering forward is Griezmann. But they dealt with the threat posed. Not a great challenge, free kick here. Man. Conte has it and one minute of stoppage time has been added on and slipped through beautifully will he shoot? the fans hope so palmed away by the keeper a chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half time here So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. move this from France and credit is due for that good piece of defending might be a chance here brilliant save it's going to be a Belgium throw in so making the substitution now De Bruyne. Oh, he couldn't out with the keeper. And De Bruyne firing it over. Cleared away comprehensively.
Coman. Back to Rabio. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come. Griezmann. And Belgium might be onto something in the wide area. Lukaku. Nicely timed tackle. Kunde. Now Rabio. Oh, they have it again. Luca Bacchio. Conte. Rabio. Mbappe. And here's Dembele. Oh, good hands there from the keeper. A failure to keep it on the part of Belgium. It's an excellent looking attack, courtesy of Griezmann here. And defensive play to be applauded. Luca Bacchio. De Bruyne. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Now he must favour the cross. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And they're making a change. They take it short. De Bruyne. Tongan Tielemans Carrasco now Onana on to Castagna the cross is on really good build up but no end product Ten minutes left for play. Lukaku. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. Now well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Rabio. Now Griezmann. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. And the substitution will occur now. And we've entered the final five minutes. Coman now to the front post well, it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it left the boot Lukaku Eduardo Camavinga pressure exerted but he keeps the ball tension building still level must take the lead here a good and fair challenge. Fass. Here's Tielemans. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time.
So back in business here, the first period of extra time, and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? Fass. Well, standing off them here, are they being too passive? De Bruyne. Here's Carrasco. They're relying very much on the passing game in a bid to take the lead. Well, it didn't worry the keeper. Dembele Kamavinga Turan Strong hand on that one Good piece of closing down Who can he pick out? Well, nothing for the players in the middle to work with Mercado. Good move in the making from France. And thwarted by Vertonghen. Fass. Kevin De Bruyne. Here's Tielemans. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. And teammates to play it to. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And the first period of extra time comes to an end. Still level here. And so the drama continues here. We're into the second period of extra time. Just wasn't going to part with the ball. Tielemans here's Carrasco how about the cross Tielemans And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Radio. It's with Kingsley Coman. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. The fans are shouting, shoot! Well, here's the replay, and as you can see, he doesn't read the danger at all, does he? It's a poor piece of goalkeeping.
And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? And the referee blows the whistle that every French fan wanted to hear. France are through to the final here at the European Championship. Well, it was always going to be tight, but they just about had enough energy and quality in that extra time to take them through to the final. Yes, there'll be some tired legs out there, but they won't care about that. What a final we've got in store for us.